Tamara earns $22.50 per hour as a child and youth care worker for the City of New Westminster. She is paid time and a half for hours over 40 hours a week. Calculate Tamara's gross income for working 45 hours in one week. Well, the first thing we can do is we can calculate Tamara's um, wage for the first 40 hours because we know that she gets paid $22.50 an hour. So that's $22.50 per hour times 40 hours. So we're multiplying a, a rate here. Okay, so our hours are going to cancel out. We're going to wind up with the amount of money earned after 40 hours. So on a calculator, I can simply press what is 22.50 times 40. And that is $900. Okay, so that's... $900. And now what's left to do is to calculate how much Tamara earned in overtime pay. Now we know she worked 45 hours in one week uh, because that's what it says right here. So we look at this and um, it says, oh, let's use a normal pen highlighter here. Okay, so it's a 45 hours in one week. So she's worked five hours of overtime. So if I were to take those five hours and I'm going to multiply that by the 2250 per hour, but she gets paid what's called time and a half. So we're going to multiply this times 1.5 for time and a half. That means her wage is uh, increased for those overtime hours. Uh, and it's the increase by 1.5 times her normal hourly wage. So if we plug this into a calculator, we get 5 times 2250 times 1.5, which is $168.75. So here we have $168. and 75 cents. So here what I have here is this is the um, overtime earned. So here we have overtime. And then here we have what's called regular time. And so her gross earnings for the week are her regular time plus her overtime. So we're going to add these uh, together. So here we have the her gross earnings. So we have $900. Plus... Uh, $168.75. Okay. Well, what is that? That is simply, I'm able to put our answer in, in blue here. That's going to be $1,000. And $68. and 75 cents. And we're done.